So that's what I got on Strowman's off speed right here. Uh, let me know in the comments what you guys think it is and uh, give me a reason why you think it's that. Because like I said, at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter what it is. We'll just call it a breaking ball and he struck out six with that pitch alone. So let me know in the comments what you think and give me a reason why you think that. Have some fun with it. All right, guys. Till next time. The biggest thing that I look for with guys that, that throw tight, sharp breaking balls like this is how does he deliver the pitch? I know in that one slide in which he's talking about his, his uh, secondary pitch grips, you can't hear it, but what he's saying is that he's thinking fastball. And I, I love just the way that you can tell his mentality right here is just fastball, fastball, fastball in that last second, like we saw in that previous slide, is that he's got so much pressure and tension on that middle finger that when he's coming through, man, he's he's getting after it. And then he's just allowing that that middle finger to just press down on that seam and that's why you're seeing such a good cr created axis by that and going over to this uh, screen over here i'll include it in the post but uh, you'll see that his spin right here on that on that pitch is 2868 so he's creating a ton of spin and usually by creating a ton of spin you're getting later break which you definitely see in this in this uh in this pitch right here so He's really, uh, he's really pulling down on that seam right there. And a, a big indicator for me to determine if it's slider or curveball is we'll, we'll watch it release. So you'll see that, hopefully you can see my monitor pretty good, but you'll see that at release, the axis that the ball is creating after that is more of a slider axis. Um, and then obviously you'll see the break. Uh, could be argued a curveball, could be argued a slider. Um, to me, it doesn't really matter.